Good morning, guys. Welcome to travel day. Mm -hmm. We're doing another travel day within our own holiday. Yeah. We are just leaving Warwick um, area, Premier Inn, and heading to where we're we going? Centre Park. Centre Park. So our holiday within a holiday. Exciting for Centre Park. Mm -hmm. I think this is the bit he's been looking forward to the most. I think all of us too. Bit of R and R, and then a lot of cycling and swimming in the middle. Um, it's about a two hour, 20 minute drive there. We need to stop off at Morrison's before we get into Centre Parks. They sent us a message last night saying we can't get until 12 um, into the park. You used to be able to get in a lot earlier, but they are staggering it a little bit now because of, sorry, because of COVID. Um, and we can't get into the lodge until four. So it's now just before nine. So we will see you at Centre Parks. On our way to Centre Parks, we have come past this place. I'll get David to leave where we are down below because I wasn't paying much attention. But this is where they are parking lots of old planes that have been scrapped and during the pandemic, lots of planes that aren't flying. Where are we? Kemble. Kemble. It's an old RAF base, is that right? Yep. And these planes are still working? That one's not. Oh yeah, it's got no engine. <laughs> but look over there, it's the BA-747. This is a restricted zone by the way, so I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be filming. Through there, 747. Not sure if I can see it. Am I supposed to be filming or not? Very cool though. I want to go on a plane, Daddy. We've arrived in Centre Parks. Stopped off at Morrison's before we got in here. And I just parked up, plugged the car in. We've got a great spot because of the electric. Oh, the, I'm pretty sure that's the only electric in the park. It is, the there's park. four charging points and we took one of them. So if we charge it for a couple of hours, then we'll just probably move it to a main space later on. But someone else can use it because we don't need to plug it in for the whole five days. No. Just heading off to the um, main centre, the village, what's it called? Plaza. Plaza. And going swimming. We've got swimming booked in for half one. We were able to get four swimming slots. Excited. So we have just been on our first swimming session. How was that, Harry? Good. Yeah, it was really, really good fun. Uh, so you get a two hour session now um, at Centre Parks. It's all, all timed entry. It's not just access whenever you want, just to try and reduce it for social distancing and reduce capacity. Even though the rules and regulations obviously aren't in place now in England, they have got positive feedback about it. I don't know if I've mentioned that before. What was your best bit in there? Um, probably um, the big, big green slide. Yeah. Water slide. Yeah. The, um, we will film next time we're in there. We didn't film today because we just wanted to get our bearings. Uh, we can't get in our lodge for another half an hour. We're heading back to the car now. Maybe picking up the bikes. Ooh. We'll see. That's what we're doing now. So we're just waiting to pick up our bikes. How many? So many bikes. So the gentleman there is serving us and he brings our bikes over. So we've got four adult bikes and one kid's bike. <laughs> and a lot. So this is a large. Can I grab your initials, please? What's your, what's your initials, Harry? H A. Hey, yeah. your initials. H A. H A. Good evening. 
So it's quite a few number of hours later. We didn't even have a chance to do a rune tour yet because David and I had to go to the laundrette. Um, there's no, they don't do service washes here. So we had to go and find a laundrette in the local town. So we went to Warminster and we've only just got back. Um, issues with the oven. So now we are just heading up to the sports plaza for some dinner. Just parked up our bikes. You like it? Yeah. You like the house? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we'll do a room tour at some point. I'll show you quickly around when we get back, but I will try and do a room tour before we absolutely trash the house, but I'm assuming that's going to be in a separate vlog. So now we're just heading on to the sports cafe at the sports plaza. just wanted to do a quick lodge tour this is your key it's like a um, magic band style access this is um, one of the basic lodges so you've got a hallway here and you've got lots of hanging space there you've got lots of room in here to store your suitcases and your luggage you've also got cleaning equipment extra cots iron and ironing board here you have got an extra toilet and in here, these two don't come as standard as normal. We've got a nice dining table. Yeah, they're just for me, unfortunately. Sorry, didn't mean that. We did find a safe. Oh, yeah, we found a safe. So lots and lots of seating. Huge seating area here. You've got a log fire, which you can burn. You can burn. You can buy um, logs from the general store, or we, we brought some with us. Nice telly. Nice big garden area out here with a barbecue and lots of seating. The kitchen area comes equipped with everything you need. You've got a dishwasher, You've got an oven and a hob, all gas, I'm afraid. The oven is a little bit tricky to light. You get a Tassimo coffee machine and it comes with four, four free pods, but you can purchase more in the uh, park mark and everything you really need. Cups, glasses, of course, wine glasses, toaster, fridge, microwave, kind of everything you need. So this is a three bedroom lodge. Um, you've got the sort of master bedroom with a double bed in got two wardrobes this is a wardrobe for hanging space so plenty of storage for a weekend break and that one over there has got shelves on it you've got two bedside tables which both have plug sockets and usb ports which is really cool which is great you get a bit of a table and a hair dryer you get a hair dryer in i think each of the rooms so this is one of the twin rooms here. This is one of the ones that the kids was using. Same style wardrobes here and here as the master bedroom. And a hairdryer and somewhere to do your makeup and hair in the mornings. This lodge only comes with one bathroom. So that's here. With a shower, a bath, sink, big mirror. And a really great... Um, towel rail which is lovely and heated and you can dry all your clothes and last bedroom here is another twin again with plugs but only one bedside table another hair dryer here another big mirror and a slightly different wardrobe, wardrobe set up so you've got hanging space there and drawers down there what have you thought of the lodge boys the executive lodges do come with two bathrooms, which is better, but it's worked for us, hasn't it? So we are back from the sports plaza now. Food was okay. It was okay. It was edible. I had scampi and chips. We didn't vlog before we gobbed. 
because we were so hungry. David dropped the burger and with a, he ordered an extra side of bacon to go with it. It wasn't crispy, so he didn't eat it. It needs to be crispy American bacon. When will the Brits learn? The kids had chicken nuggets. It's just chicken nuggets. It was all right. Um, we went for a bit of a cycle around the lake, found a better way up the hill because Longley is very, very hilly. Um, it's got dark really quickly outside and we've had to unpack. It's still a little bit of a mess. Yeah, you can all that. So David and I have got the double bed. The kids have got this room here. Alan has got the room there, there's a bathroom there. And the boys are watching telly. Wave to the vlog. There we go. I've got a glass of wine. Busy day tomorrow. All is good. I'm not sure what this vlog is going to be like at all. It's been a bit manic, shall we say. Um, I can see myself vlogging. It's really weird. Um, yeah, it's been a very, very manic, strange kind of day. Very busy, obviously, travel day down here. Bit of shopping, getting here, swimming. We filmed a little bit of the dome or the subtropical paradise. I just need to chill out for a minute. I'm going to go and enjoy my glass of wine, plan what we're going to do for the rest of the week and um, have a cookie. So thanks for watching. If you Thanks for bearing with me if you've watched it. Um, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up. Leave any comments down below. Uh, tell us about your first days here at Centre Parks. What do you normally do on your first day? We normally come at 10 o'clock in the morning and spend all day in the pool till we have to check into our villa. Um, obviously it's different now, but that's what we normally do. What do you normally do on your first day? Do you arrive late? Do you arrive early? Where do you go? Do you book activities? So let us know. Um, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.